What's up guys, my name is Selena and I live in a remote Alaskan village that shares my last name. And tonight we're gonna go pick up my groceries from the air taxi. It is currently 6.30, the sun is setting. It's absolutely beautiful. And the air taxi, even though it's literally right down the hill, right there, we're gonna be using a combination of the sled and my four-wheeler, the North Star, to grab everything. We're gonna hook it up. I think that's gonna work great. And then we'll go. And just for reference, this village is literally 160 miles from the nearest store, so everything, absolutely everything, has to be flown in. Let's pick up groceries. So when I'm picking up my groceries, I just come here to the air taxi and I look for Port Allsworth stuff, which is always on this shelf. And I look for my freight and this is how. Each village has a, with our air taxi, has a color combination or one color sticker. So for Port Allsworth, it's blue, and then my name. So I'm looking for all the stuff that has Selena with a blue sticker, and I'm gonna put it on my four-wheeler or in my sled. That's fine there. To have things shipped out here, it's about 90 cents a pound for Port Allsworth. However, for some other villages, it can be up to $2.25 per pound, and if I'm shipping it priority, it's about $1.50 per pound. I dropped off all this stuff a week ago in Anchorage, and it's just now getting to me. And that's normal for this time of year, because in the winter time, weather is unreliable. As you can see out here, it's kind of icy and warm. So it takes a lot longer for things to get out here this time of year because of the weather. Sometimes I can get my stuff the same day, other times it can take up to a week. I also got a box from the Goodyears. I'm gonna be opening it when I get home, but it's Mickey Mouse ears. A friend from college makes them and she's fantastic. And we're going to Disney World in March, so I'm super excited about these ears and I can't wait to show you guys which ones I got. When I'm shopping, <laughs> when I'm shopping, I'm looking for things that are going to be lasting me a long time. So things that are shelf safe or are able to last long in the freezer. Fridge stuff, you know, it doesn't last very long. But I want to have a grocery order that lasts me about, you know, three months. These seltzer waters, even though they're not as fantastic as the Croix, they are about a dollar cheaper for double the amount, basically. And all this is gonna last me about three months. Or at least I hope it's gonna last me three months, we'll see. That tote was the last thing. So we have everything and now we're going to head home. And I know people are gonna ask me, Selena, it's Alaska, where's your coat? Well, it is currently 40 degrees here. I know, in Alaska. So I've been wearing a t-shirt all day.
it's all upstairs. The worst part is carrying it from the four-wheeler truck here, but let's take it all inside. Beasley, hi, baby. Hi. Did you miss me? Now that we're back in the house, we're gonna go through the stuff that I bought together. Let me reposition. Okay, perfect, this is good. Awesome, okay, so. I feel like these are self-explanatory. Just little cups of mandarins and peaches. I like to have these to include in my lunch. I also have canned stuff in my pantry, but one of this also. I also got a whole bunch of sparkling waters and I like this kind because as I said before, it's cheaper than LaCroix. Not as good as LaCroix, but cheaper than LaCroix. And this mango flavor is my absolute favorite and I have not been able to get it recently. So I'm so happy. Mm. I'm hoping these last me three months. We'll see. Let's open my package from the Good Ears. I am very excited about these ears. Also, this is a butter knife. If you guys know, don't freak out. It's cute and has bubble wrap. We have a little thank you card and a business card as well as my receipt and then the grand reveal oh my gosh can you guys tell who this is oh my goodness y'all she hand makes these oh my word Oh my gosh. Okay, these are cozy. They don't hurt at all. Look at those. Look at that. Okay, let's look at the back. Super cute and seems really high quality. Nice. Now we have, I can't even lift it with the huge tote. So let me show you guys what I got. It's a mix of things from Walmart, from Myers, Target. So I've done hauls on my TikTok lives of the last tote that I got, but I wanna include the haul on this one. So some of the stuff I can't show you because they're presents, but we'll go through what we can. So I just thought these were interesting. It's literally hot chocolate with the Lucky Charms marshmallows. Different. Fun. Wanted to include, include it in my little coffee bar. I really needed a little brush for my water bottles and actually for my straws because I have a lot of straws and I feel like I'm not cleaning them well enough. So I got this at Target. Excited about that one. I have been currently cutting my hair with kitchen scissors which is so bad but I found these just scissors, shears I guess, at Target. So I'm really excited to not be using kitchen scissors anymore. And I think my hair will appreciate me more. I also got a flannel. I've been really wanting a nice flannel, especially since a lot of, it's a nice just pullover instead of a jacket. So I got it in a size bigger than I normally am, but that was the point. I got this jar. One of my followers sent me this sleepy time tea that has like, you know, stuff to calm your body down. And I've been making it in the evenings, like a cold jar of it and keeping it in my, or a pitcher of it, keeping it in my fridge. But I wanted to have a designated jar for it. So I bought this one and it is also from Target. Another crop top tea. I like to put, um, like my tunic shirts underneath it. Kind of just give it some layers. Candles, because the candles I have on there just don't match my aesthetics, like they're pretty, 
and they're fancy and I definitely want to put them out more towards summertime but these ones I'm gonna have on display when it's not summertime <laughs> and they are from uh, Target the hearth and hearth in hand brand by Magnolia my favorite if you can't tell there I can point I also got these also from Target I'm really excited and they're only ten dollars I really like these kind of shoes and I was thinking about taking them with me when we go on vacation to Florida. I got Beasley roses for Valentine's Day because that girl deserves some roses. You know, like some roses? She's like looking for the stuff. Also got them from Target. Do they come out? Oh, they sure do. Beasley, do you like some roses? I also got these bunnies to add to my Easter decor. Where exactly I'm going to put them, I am not sure yet, so stay tuned. I might put them on my piano, but they're cute. They're also from Target. I also bought hair dye. This is the same exact brand that I used before when I had it, my summer look, so I'm thinking about doing it again. I don't know. We'll see. I definitely want to get it professionally done. I got this table runner also from Target and I really wanted something spring, Easter looking. Beasley was taking her flowers everywhere. I was also told I need to be using combs in my hair so I bought combs to comb it out um, when I'm in the shower so also from Target. They're also from Target. I freaking love these so much. I had them for the first time when I was in college um, visiting a friend in Washington DC and I literally couldn't stop eating them. So I bought some also from Target. But when we got them in DC, it was from Costco. This is another thing I found on TikTok. It's these charcoal pour strips for your nose. I heard after I bought them, uh, somebody told me they're actually really bad for your nose and for your skin. So yay me we'll see how this goes i do not own a bird pan i know crazy so i bought a bread pan and it's from target i'm really excited so i can make my own bread i think that's better than buying bread you know plus i like making it it's fun i also bought food dye because i like making cupcakes and frostings and stuff like that and really just needed something for the color honey from target big fan honey don't remember how much it cost but i remember that it was really painful it was really expensive and then you know i just got essentials like things i was running low on and seasonings i was running low on medication vitamins kitchen stuff literally that's the rest of this tote not very exciting all of it i got from either walmart fred meyers or target Mostly Walmart and Fred Myers because it's a little bit cheaper. I'm glad you like your roses. Oh, sorry. It's underneath the dishwasher. And that's it. That's how I get my groceries in remote Alaska. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, give this video a big thumbs up, and go check out my Instagram, my TikTok, having a little bit pro of problems recently, so staying off of that for a little while, but you can always find me here and on my Instagram. See you guys later. Peace.